but I still look cute. If you're wondering what is all of this happening, this is my head scarf to put around my head. So my hair don't mess up while I'm in the gym. I just did not want to leave it at home. So I just made sure I grabbed it while I was headed out. So I just threw it around my neck just in case so I don't leave it. But today is Mark's 25 days left of school. Woo I'm super excited about that kids are probably also super excited about that today is also our b day it's b day which means i hurry up and stop to get and got brownies because we can eat things that's not with the b we do b activities like we're gonna have bubbles outside we're gonna have we're gonna play this game called blue kid uh it's a computer game i believe i may have mentioned it before if you guys are not aware of it it is an online game where the students have so much fun they get to see we, they have them um, like a cash box or whatever online on their um computer screens and you can take other people's money you can you gotta pick it's like you can do avengers you can do disney movies you can do cartoon network you can do mickey mouse characters movie scenes it's all type of cool stuff it's all different kind of games but the kids seem to love this specific one with the chess so definitely tap into that if you are a teacher looking for something new to do for your classroom especially if you're looking for something fun some fun activities regarding the students i cannot believe i'm behind this slow ass car like i gotta get the fuck on like what the fuck it's always like that in the morning guys i just be trying to get around these cars and they just be blowing my mind but overall i woke up with a charlie horse in my cab like a, a major 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 cramp in my cab and it hurt so bad i could i did not think i was going to be able to get up this morning because that's how bad it was hurting me so i was just like oh no but then after that i ended up um it ended up starting to get better so i was like oh okay i just kind of like massaged it out so it could get better, but it still hurts. I feel it when I walk, but it isn't like the worst like it was when I first woke up this morning. So hopefully it doesn't get worse, or hopefully it doesn't like affect my day in any kind of way. So yeah, let's see how we are gonna do today. We are not gonna be watching anything that starts with a B because we tried that yesterday. We watched some something on Netflix called Arlo the Alligator Boy some weird stuff like that it was actually pretty weird but it also was pretty interesting it was called arlo the alligator boy it was pretty like i said it was a pretty weird video um movie but it was pretty weird and funny at the same exact time and the kids seemed to love it so they loved it enough because we didn't even get to finish it because the time ran out of school we get um out early on wednesdays so i if A was today, we probably would have been able to finish it, but whatever. We're not watching a movie or anything today if they don't behave. Um, I already told them it's straight up no because they I did not like how they handled the movie yesterday. They were talked through the entire time, and they just didn't care for it. So I was just like, if y'all don't care about the movie, y'all don't need to watch a movie. Simple as that. So boom. So don't ask me because I'm going to tell you no. And then... um. So I may still do it today because just on the simple fact that the day, the days are counting down and it's a full activity. The other class watched the Avengers was, was crazy though, but I should have thought of that. And then they was talking about Batman today. So we might watch Batman today if I'm in the mood for Batman because Batman is mad though. And I'm just like a Marvel and a DC comic book kind of anime kind of person. So I may use it to my advantage. <laughs> not even lying so yeah guys that is that like people just be silly it's like why would you drive in my corner like clearly i can't see you dummy like people are stupid for no reason um anywho that's that guys I, um it is 7 31 i am currently about to pull into the parking lot of park and go into the classroom i sure hope you guys have a wonderful day today of course as you know it i'm tara J. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'm out. Peace. Good morning. Good morning. The sun is kissing on me today. Look at that. Look at my skin, honey. Okay, I see it. It's Friday. My skin feeling like it's Friday. The sun out. Today is going to be a great day. Okay, as you know, it. I am headed to school. It is 7 20. I knew that the 
about to come on. So there's that. <laughs> it kind of ruined my little thing. But like I said, good morning. I am headed to school per usual. It is 7.30. I am running late. I wish I was not running late, but I am running late. But okay, it also is Friday. So I'm not too mad about that. And um, like I said, I, I know that today is going to be a good day. Today is the second video of my part three teacher diaries. I hope you guys have been enjoying those because I just be talking y'all ear off. <laughs> I probably don't even be talking about nothing, but I just wake up in the morning and I'm feeling wonderful. So I feel like I just want to share my good energy with you guys and how I just be feeling wonderful every single morning. And that is by choice. Like I can wake up like today. I woke up cramping, but you know, I'm still choosing to feel wonderful. I'm still choosing to have a wonderful day. So I'm just going to have a wonderful day because I want to and I'll just pop some at, um, Abby Pofrance <laughs> throughout the day and pray that I don't die. So yeah, there's that. And I just want to say that being a teacher is a wonderful thing. Even though sometimes some kids be driving me crazy, I be wanting to pull my hair out. I just, I'm happy that I actually am where I am. And the coolest thing is that I actually went to this school from kindergarten to eighth grade. So it feels like it's like, oh, reminiscent, even though the teachers were like through 10 times worse than what we are now. Like, um, first of all, they were so much older than us. You had like a paddle because it's a Catholic school. They had a paddle in like every single classroom, even if they didn't even use it. They had it in there to scare mugs because they wasn't even using the paddle really on nobody. Like, I'm not even lying. I don't think they ever even used the paddle one time on anybody in the classroom. That's the thing about that. So it was just literally for scare. And <laughs> I don't know if it scared me or not because I was mad as hell still. So <laughs> that's the difference between this and now. I guess also because we're younger too. Like I said, I said that already. They're older. We're younger, obviously. And I don't know. The dynamic is just completely different. It's so much. It's a smaller school now. It used to be a big. You used to utilize the entire school. It used to just be big with a whole bunch of kids running around. You don't see half as much kids running around as it was when I was born there. But hey, times has changed. Generations has changed. Life has changed. But yeah, there's that, guys. It's Friday. I hope to see you guys after school or throughout the day. I am going to try to get a movie in during the day because I always try to let them watch movies and relax on Friday. So I'm going to go ahead and see how that works based on behavior and chill out. All right. That's Tara J. As you know it, peace.
for eBay today, but I left this shit at home, so I gotta stop at the gas station before I go into the work. Hopefully they got it. I need some fucking gas. My man is going fucking everywhere right now, and I'm just super unorganized this morning. Like, I got hella bags all over the fucking place. I just got... I just got a lot of shit happening <laughs> up in the car, if y'all can see it right there. There's a lot going on, my mind is going too fast for me. So it's like, I am I can very relate to the kids when they was like, I can't, I can't, it's just my mind going too fast. Like my kids really be saying it and I feel like I get it because mine, I'm about to be damn near 30 and my brain is still going faster than me. So I get it, it's a hard, a hard, hard, hard struggle to deal with your brain going so fast because mine is going extra fast and I just don't know what to do. I'm just kind of like stuck. The only thing with them is they go fast too. Like they move their bodies repeatedly. They jog in place. They dance. They run. They talk. They get the jitters. They bounce up and down. Me, I'm just like I stare into space and I do my fingers like this basically. Or I just go into space and I stare into space. This man is finger fist pumping in front of the car and I will hit him as soon as the light turned green so I will hope that he will get his ass out of my way uh, he's gone now but anyways you guys can see him back there but anyway yeah guys that's that today's Tuesday um I need to go to my sister house today so I may vlog that hanging with the kiddos but I'm like hella tired like it's 7 30 it's 7 28 well, I don't know what the call is. I guess I, I'm tired. Like, why would you... People walk across the street. The light been green for two minutes. Like, what in the fuck? But, yeah. I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. I am going to try my best to have a great day as well. And, as you know, guys, I'm Tara J. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I'm out. Peace. So I'm like hella annoyed that this fucking gas station is closed because I fucking need to go in there for the shit today. I'm gone. This shit gonna have to stop. Hold on truck. Can I go? Big ass. I fucking hate people. I don't hate people. I'm just saying people are just so inconsiderate. Like somebody gonna have to stop because I'm going. I don't care. I'm holding up traffic. Fuck y'all. But, um, yeah, I'm at school. Bye. What is up, beautiful people? It's me, Tara J. As you know it, I am dropping in for my last video of the um, Teacher Diaries 3. I had an extremely bomb day today. Like, extremely fun day. Like, it was so funny. We Today was G day, so technically we have about 20 days of school left. And, um today was g day basically same as game day or whatever so we went outside and we played kickball it was so freaking fun um i probably had more fun i'm sorry if it's shaking hold on okay i probably had more fun than like the kids i'm not even lying me and my cousin because she teach upstairs at um seventh grade but they happened to be outside at the same time so oh no they had gym at the same time and we came outside it was, everybody was outside at the same time it was kind of crazy but so she ended up playing on the other team <laughs> and we literally had more fun than they did like i'm not even lying like i have, feel like i have not played kickball in a long time because man you i went to the school when i was we both did actually we went to the school when we was little so that was the funniest thing ever. We ended up playing. Then we came back to the classroom. We played Mystery Killer. We played um, Guess That Animal. So Guess That Animal is basically like um, the, the kid got to act out the animal or whatever. And you got to guess which animal is with who is this person. So if I say like do a giraffe or something like that, the little girl got real tall. <laughs> She got like really, 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 really tall. Even though she probably like one of the shortest people in the classroom. She tried her best to get really tall. So they instantly was like, giraffe, giraffe. So they had a good time. I had a good time. They had a good time. We did relay races also too. I just instantly thought of that on the spot because we was waiting on the bell and kickball stuff to get set up. So we ended up doing relay races outside and it was like the first team who win 
the team who win, um, win popsicles. So I ended up giving popsicles to the majority of the class anyway because we ended up doing a mystery killer and whoever gets it get the popsicle. So um I had two popsicles myself. <laughs> But anyway, guys, I had an awesome day today. The kids love today. I hope tomorrow is H day. I don't really got any games prepared, so I may just do them. Let them finish teaching because like, we're I'm doing this thing where we took a break because we did an end of the year assessment for like a week and a half. Not even lie, because it was like 12 pages. Some people still need to finish. Honestly, it was like 12 pages, and um. I'm giving them a break. So what I did was I'm not letting them teach the class. So what I gave two days ago, I gave them homework saying make um, a lesson plan for the class. So you're gonna be teaching us something. Pick one thing that we um went over all year in math, and you're gonna all talk for 10 minutes and teach the class for 10 minutes. So so we got we've been doing this since yesterday, and then tomorrow is the last day. We gotta finish it up, and then everything should be finished i got bit up everybody was like i'm so itchy i'm so itchy outside with a mosquito shoot i'm itchy too <laughs> i'm a human just like you i'm itchy as hell so i think i'm gonna end up bringing more popsicles tomorrow or honey bun honey buns i was thinking because it started with an h i could not think of anything else that started with an h so that was literally my last resort but i'm gonna think i'm gonna bring popsicles too and then I'm gonna turn around and bring popsicles on P day too, cause it's P. But they end up loving the popsicle idea, and um, yeah, <laughs> I had an awesome day. They had they had so much fun. We had a great day actually, and then we had gym today too. So today was pretty dope. Today was pretty 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 dope. <laughs> a great Thursday. I wish I would have vlogged yesterday. Was actually pretty dope too. We had a field day yesterday, and um. We had like this, it was kind of like a mini carnival. It was different stations. They can go to this station in color. They had rock climbing. They had a um, um, a relay race, or like an obstacle course kind of thing, relay race. They had um, hula hoops. They had dodgeball. They had pitch frame stuff. Like, it was hella dope. Like these, this week has been like pretty cool. I actually, now that I think about it, I wish I would have vlogged. I might vlog tomorrow. We're also raising butterflies, but every time I go to the butterflies, it one actually came out and finally hashed out of the out of the chrysalis. We're still waiting on the other three to come out. So I did leave the little food in there to um for the one butterfly to eat because I did not want it to not eat. I wasn't really sure. I watched a few videos and I was just like, okay, so did they wait on it to come out or what? But it's been more than three to six hours and the other butterflies did not come out but that one. So I was just like, let me go ahead and feed this baby. So it don't die. So I was just like, whatever. And I left it in there. Hopefully it don't, like, it say don't leave it in there because it's going, it could fall in. But it's just like a, like a, a sponge. Like, I, I don't think that that would matter. I would think that if it was like an orange or like a plate of liquid, that's what they mean. But I'm crossing my fingers and I really hope I don't, I don't kill the butterfly because I'm going to be sad, and they going to be sad too. So we're just crossing our fingers that the other three come out as well. And yeah, today was hella dope. Again, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, guys. As you know it, I'm Tara J. This is the end of part three, Teacher Chronicles. And yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, another thing is, I, 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 just, I literally just talked right off my brain when we was doing the, um, murder mystery who killed who i literally made up this story like right up the top that's how i know i need to write a book okay i'm writing a book stay tuned it's probably gonna be a kid book it may be a murder mystery i don't even know but it's gonna be something and it's gonna be raw okay all right guys as you know it i'm tara j and i'm out peace